Good morning everyone. Um, it's Monday today and I'm just all ready because I'm going to Wimbledon. So I'm going to Wimbledon with Bista Village um, and we're going to go on, I don't know, court one I think for today. So we get there about half ten and then we leave at half six. So it's me and Lizzie and then there's a couple of other influencers there as well. <laughs> James! <What? laughs> Blowing his nose so loud, honestly, every day. Um, so anyway, so we went to Bista Village and picked out an outfit for the occasion. So I went to Loewe and got this amazing shirt. I think it like it could maybe look like I'm wearing like a patchwork quilt, but I love it. So it's a big shirt and it's just, um, I've, I've borrowed Lizzie's little silk black skirt to put underneath because it is quite like short. So it's just got lots of different patches of silk and cotton and it's um, asymmetric so it buttons up the wrong way. And then the back is just black. I'll show you quickly, but I love it. I know it'll be like, you know, each to their own. But yeah, I really like it. And then I've just got some red little heels on. I'm gonna be boiling. It was like 30 degrees yesterday and I've not slept neither as James. It was just so hot. I even bought a fan. It was just pushing hot air around the room. <laughs> but I hope you're all all right. Um, I'm feeling back into the swing of vlogging. I'm sorry it's been off the boil a bit, um, but this one will be better I promise so I'll take you along to the tennis today I've got loads of good stuff going on this week so I can take you along for all of that as well um, and yeah I'll speak to you later just done my standard thing guys um so Lizzie hasn't really checked her emails this whole process through I've been doing it all never let me do that so I was like right I see you at quarter past nine in the morning because taxi starts me off at nine she's like right fine sat here ten past quarter past Thought I'd better check this email. 10 o'clock. <laughs> so I got up. I'm ready an hour and 15 minutes early, so I'm just doing some work. Honestly, never ask me to organise anything. Well, look what we've got. We're not drinking, but we are going to eat these. It's still 4%. <laughs> we're not drinking, we're only on it. <laughs> oh. Having such a lovely day so far. Oh, my fringe is fancy. Um, we are at Wimbledon, as I told you. Wrap it up. It's what? nearly melted already. Oh, <laughs> gotta go, gotta go. <laughs> Hello everyone, um, I hope you're all okay and you've had a nice day. Um, I'm obviously back from Wimbledon now and it was such a good day. I'm absolutely knackered, <laughs> I'm so tired. Um, so um, we came back, had tea, Lizzie came for tea and then we have just watched Love Island. <laughs> And then we have watched Handmaid's Tale and I need to just have a quick shower. Is this really bright? Sorry, there's so many spots. Oh, that's better. Oh, that's not. Anyway, um, yeah. And so we just watched um, Handmaid's Tale. But I'm so tired. I need to have a shower. I've got a shoot day all day tomorrow. Well, for four hours, half day. So I've got loads to do to sort out. And I'm just, I'm, I've not been sleeping very well because it's so hot. And I'm sure everyone hasn't either. I've even bought a bloody fan. Let me tell you, it's not worth it. So I'll say night to you all now anyway, and then um, I'll catch up with you tomorrow. I probably can't vlog whilst on the shoot because it's going to be a quick turnaround, but apart from that I will um, speak to you after after um, after the shoot. But yes, thank you for coming along today. You have no choice because I'm the vlogger. <laughs> I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. Night. Good morning everyone. It's Tuesday today and I'm just all ready now to leave for my shoot. Um, I've got my first look on, but I'm, I'll, I'll do, I'm going to do a haul of it all for you so you can see it all properly. Um, but this is amazing. Um, under the story stress. And yeah, I'm going to leave in about 10. Um, I've got six looks to shoot, and I'm, but I'm really tired again this morning. I slept all right as well last night, but my little eyes are all like puffy and small. No amount of mascara is helping me out this morning. But it'll be fine. As soon as I've been up a bit, hopefully it'll be... Oh, I 
don't know. I don't know. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what's going on today. Like I said yesterday, the shoot. And then I'm going out to watch England play tonight with Kim, Simon and James. So that'll be really nice. Um, so yeah, I'm literally just waiting for my car to come. I've got a really nice week this week. So I'll take you along for everything. And uh, old Jimmy James is here. Mm. Not wearing a t-shirt as usual. Mm. <laughs> Hello everyone, so I'm back from shooting, it was a very successful morning, um, we were really quick and I got everything that I needed to get, so me and James are just going to go for a walk now, um, I've got some ASOS to take back as usual, and um, get a coffee, just really desperately want a nice coffee, I'm not drink eating dairy at the moment so it's hard to get a good coffee at home with soya milk because it all just tastes a bit weird, um, so yeah we're going to go for a walk up the top, and then we're going to watch the footy tonight, lads, 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 lads. Do you want to sing a Come On England chant? Um, I'm okay at one. <laughs> Just you wait until later on when he's had a beer. Um, so we're going to Box Park in Shoreditch and I hate going to Shoreditch but it's worth it because we're going to see our mates and actually watch some football so that'd be good. So I'm just wearing um, this warehouse dress which is linen, I think you've seen this before. It's got like a cross back, oh that's my toilet there, that's nice. It's got like a cross over at the back, um, I'll try and find it online for you. as. nice walk just had a really good coffee and now i'm like Rum! um james we walked together in his running gear and he he's had a bad hamstring so he's not been running or doing his gym in for ages and he's run back but i've beat him back and i was quite a while so that means it must be going well just keeping an eye out for him um anyway another news i've just had a delivery from gorgeous edie harrop look at the bloody size of this box um, you know what I'm like, I don't usually like be like, oh, guess what, what I've got. But this is really exciting, very practical, so I feel like everyone should know about it. She says, I can't open the bloody box. <laughs> right, okay, we're in. So, this is the big dust bag that it goes in. Oh, happy travels from Eddie and Harrop. And it is, for everyone that travels a lot, a big beach tote bag. And I just think it's really cool look it's this amazing thick canvas it's really beautiful quality and it's got leather straps i'll take that off in a minute um but it fits absolutely loads in it's got a little pocket there as well i don't know if i'd take it to the beach though i think i'd take it on the plane and just make sure my laptop and everything was in it but yeah really like that really nice i think they're on netta porter now as well that's a very nice treat, especially because I'm going away so much. So me and Lizzie are going to LA on the 17th, so that's like really soon. Oh, wait up. Left the window open on our car. Car got broken into the other day, but not really broken into because I think one of us left the door open. Um, and they just took all the change from the middle bit, including Euros, so God knows. Didn't damage any of the car, just ransacked it. But I mean, the car's 15 years old, so you know. Honestly, I asked myself why I love James and this is part of the reason. Look at these lunches. Knocks them up like nobody's business. Too many beers to drive his bike home. Oh, my friend just fine. <laughs> my friend just fine. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Well, well, well. Someone is as rough as a bear's ass. Um, oh, God, I just can't drink. Can I? I had two big wines and a, and a Corona. Um, but the big wines were literally like drinking half a bottle. <laughs> anyway, I've got to go into town now i've got a few appointments my phone's broken so i've got to go to apple and withstand that painful pricey process um but yes i'll take you along today it's a beautiful day as usual and yeah i'm just going to try and muddle on through i'm absolutely knackered as well like <laughs> 
Good morning, both of you. Good morning. Hello. We're just in Nopi. We're going to have some iced coffees and some breakfast. the realization part pop up in Selfridges and I'm banging in love with this dress. Oh my god, it's so cool. Oh. Hello people, um, so I'm just at home, it's about three o'clock. I've had to take my phone into Apple because it's playing up, playing Merry Hell. And um, it just keeps, I'll be typing and then it just freezes and I literally can't use the screen on it. It's my own fault because I got it replaced not in an Apple store, so now it's cost me like double. <laughs> but anyway, Apple have got it, it's in safe hands. So I can pick that up in a few hours. So now, I've just come home, done some work, had some lunch with James, and I'm gonna go and see Catherine and Baby Grey. Uh, so I can't wait, because I've not seen them for like four weeks. Sorry, usual thing of my memory card filling up. Uh, yeah, so they were away, and then I was away, so it's been ages. So Grey's grown so much, um, from what I can see, like on, uh, little pictures of him and stuff so i can't bloody wait uh, so yeah i'm gonna get cracking um and do that now good morning everyone um it's thursday today and i'm up and ready and about to go to my agency vogue because um, they've got press day for samso and samso uh, who were an amazing scandi brand who i was just in copenhagen with so that should be really lovely then i'm just coming back i don't feel very well um i just don't feel full of cold. Like I woke up with like a pressure headache and stuff. And like, you know, it's just one-sided on your face. Where will it end? Um, so I feel like, you know, when your head's in like a little fish bowl like that. Anyway, um, my friend Lauren, who you know and have met from Girl vs. Uh, Girl Stole London as a blog, Girl vs. Cancer is her business. Um, she's going to come around and we're going to film a reset series that will go live actually before this vlog to be fair so you'll be able to see it once this is live um so i'm really excited to see it i'm really excited to get her on and have a chat about everything um and then i was gonna go out tonight but um i think i'm gonna save myself because i want to be well for um oh god there's just everywhere man <laughs> i want to be well for saturday um and the footy so i'm just gonna come back tidy up a bit me and lauren will film and then i've got some work to do and I just want to get ahead of stuff and just be chill so I'm gonna do that but yeah that's it today really I'm gonna I'll take you along obviously and show you what the new Samso collection looks like and take you to Varg and um, but I'm just wearing this Chloe Cassandra and um, like silky slip dress it's not silk but it's like um I don't know what the material really is oh yeah it is actually it's like a silk mix and um, but it's just really nice and cool got my super goes on um, and I'm just gonna take my mun basket bag with me as well so yeah, feeling really nice and just cool. And I've got this, oh my God, this book I need to tell you about as well. Um, I'm not gonna try and pronounce the name, which is, I know a little bit rude, but I don't wanna say it wrong, so I'll just show it to you. <laughs> and it's called The Little Black Book. And my friend Kim from Love Cloth Blog bought it for me for my birthday last year. And I've opened it about four times, just, and, and gone to the sections that I feel I've, ne I've needed at the time. But this time I've read it, I'm, I'm halfway through and I'm just gonna carry on. And the page that I always get stuck at is Money Talks Part Two, Taking Care of Business. And I can't stand it. Can't stand thinking about money, can't stand thinking about finance. And I'm just so bad at it and so bad with numbers. This kid sat her GCSE maths five times. <laughs> literally had to get a tutor and everything it was absolutely hell um so i'm just not good um and so it just literally freaks me out it's like i can't get past that page so i'm going to take it on the tube now and try and read it but it's a toolkit for working women and whether you're um freelance or not it's amazing so i'll put a little link on amazon for you to find it but honestly it is so good and i couldn't recommend it anymore so, and it's just super tiny as well so you can stick it in your bag when you're on the way to work and things um, but yeah it's quite an inspiring read and it's like it shook me up a bit because i was you know sometimes all of us just lose a bit of focus now and again with work no matter what you're doing um, and it, it, it made me hone in on a couple of things where I was like, I'm not really sure about that. And it made me just take some time to think. So yeah, I'll put that on because it's really useful. And I'm going to go now, so I'll take you along. <laughs> and I hope you're all okay. But then it's so, been crazy because they were like the centre of the heat wave. Yeah. Awesome. This is the new Samso collection that will be dropping pre-spring-summer. So I'm going to wear something like this 
twin set for fashion week in Copenhagen. So it's like a dress over wide leg trousers and I'm so excited about it. And also this. How beautiful is that? Oh, love these guys so much. They've mixed in the collection this season with men's and women's wear because obviously a lot of women like to wear men's shapes, but how good is that jumper as well? Hello everyone, we are having a coffee, just drinking some perfect. <laughs> I could see Lauren watching me going, what is she doing here? <laughs> so I'm with Lazar. I was like, what is she doing? <laughs> we just at a local little Italian deli and we've just filmed the reset series for Little Go Live actually before this vlog. So anyway, if you've not seen it by this time, go and watch it. Um, so that was really fun, we're just having a mega catch up because we've not seen each other for a bit. And we're both sweating in places that nobody should be. <laughs> Um, we are going off into town today. We were going to go to Lido, but I don't know if we're going to have time because we're going to watch the footy with a brand later for pizza and beer at like six. So we're going to go into town, get James a footy shirt for the England match tomorrow, and we're going to go to Dishoon for breakfast. But we're trying to hurry up because we might miss the breakfast and I can't bear it. Make a face at the taste. Can you take another cigarette? Me and James are out and about today. We've been and bought a footy shirt for tomorrow. We've had a really nice breakfast at Dishoom. We're just walking through Notting Hill now to go and get a little coffee. And it's just such a gorgeous day. Do you concur? Lovely. Lovely. So, I've just got an orange and ginger um, juice and it is so burny. <laughs> I'm hoping it makes me better. Yeah. A bit burny. Oh, I, I do have a lot of train socks. Sorry. James is staying in these, these short and train socks. So we're ready for our second part of today. We're going to go to um, Shoreditch again. It's twice in one week and I bloody hate Shoreditch. It's such a long way away. Um, so it's a good hour for us. Um, and yeah, we're going to... It's with American Vintage. And we're going to meet Simon and Kim again. We're going to watch the footy, have some beers and some pizzas. I've just got this um, like silky kind of, it's not silky, what is it? It's like crepey, like something you'd wear on a beach. Well, it is beach wear, but you can, it's versatile. And it's by Chloe Cassandra. And they sell it on Netta Porto as well. It's not super, super expensive, but it's also not the cheapest. But I really love this one. It's just a little mini dress, like pink leopard and a huge open um, halter neck back. So yeah, really like it. Just got to see goes on. My jewellery. And then yeah, we're off. True. You wouldn't know it. You were pushing, pulling till the sky was falling in. Undone by the fascination. Sun Good morning everyone. It's Saturday today. I am off to Pride. Well, off Pride. I'm off to Pride today. I am, am obviously, well not obviously actually, but um, Who's playing? England are playing and it, we're in the semi, no, quarterfinals now. So yeah, going to Pride for my first time ever, so I'm really excited and also then to watch the footy. So yeah, I'm just wearing like a little um, top shoppy slip dress. I'm absolutely knackered, not slept because it's so hot. I'm just full of a cold, but I'm just going to take my Prosecco and get on with it. So I'll take you along today because I think it's going to be amazing. I hope you're all okay. Yeah. Fire! Yeah. Look at that! Yeah, no. <laughs> Josh is going all out. He's got his kit on. Eat your heart. Oh my god! And I just got this little jewel. Josh, when are you ready, hun? Bloody drunk. <laughs> it's like half past eight. 
Oops, I'm away home. Just ordered a delivery in the form of Chinese. I wasn't even supposed to be drinking that much, but honestly, try telling people that you've just met who you love and they love you back, no, when they go to the bar. I was like, water please or nothing please. Every single time they came back, it was with alcohol. I've had the best day We're at Pride and we watched the football and England won and it was amazing. I'm literally so dead. I'm 30. I can't do this any longer. I'm literally like, I just want to, I'm just, well I am gonna shower. I've got glitter all over my face, hair everywhere. I've lost some gems that I had on earlier, I'm a bit annoyed about it. And then, um, that's it really. I just noticed that really abruptly because on my road there's um, some people that will share a house, like a few doors down. And honest to God, every time I get the vlog camera out, they always see me and they always watch me and they always have to stand outside smoking. Lo and behold, I come trotting past with my vlog camera again, so I was like, okay, bye. <laughs> Quick. So I can't remember what I was saying, but I was saying that having a Chinese, I'm just going to have a shower because I'm boiling my flats like the sun. Um, and then um, I'm just going to watch some, like, I'm going to watch This Is Us, actually, because season two, oh, oh season two, oh, season two is out on like more four I think and the season one was amazing so I'm gonna sit and watch that because James doesn't watch it with me and he's away in Ipswich with the boys watching the footy and being doing what boys do. Um so yeah I'm really looks looking forward <laughs> I was trying to say I'm really excited but I'm also really looking forward to so it came out as a word that was combined. So to be fair I'm in a really good state for having drunk steadily all day. Like I'm not incoherent, I'm just Merry! <laughs> but I just can't wait to get in the shower. I'm also covered in um, cider because when England scored both times, the whole place went bloody up. So of course everyone's drink did. Absolutely covered, <laughs> absolutely covered. I'm gonna take this off now as well. Oh, brilliant. No, that's just what you want, isn't it? It's not gonna go down the, oh. Good. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go now. You'll probably hear from me tomorrow. Well, you will hear from me tomorrow. I'm going for lunch, no, like a late breakfast with Lizzie in the morning. I'm gonna be in a right state, because it's like nine o'clock and I'm already in this state and I'm already getting a headache. So I'm gonna drink lots of water, have some lovely food and hope that the hangover goes away. Um, Cause you know what I'm like, I can't drink, don't drink that much. But you know, it's pride and football. So you've gotta make some exceptions, haven't you? But yeah, I hope you're all okay. And thanks for, listening to me and I'll speak to you tomorrow. <laughs> Morning you lot. Um, I hope you're all alright. It's Sunday today. Um, I'm not feeling too bad at all actually because I was in for like I think half nine and then oh, and then um, I had a Chinese and loads of water. So I think I'm fine. I'm going for breakfast with Lizzie now and um, yeah it's boiling out isn't it. Bloody water's gone up in our house as well so that's not good. But yeah, I'm gonna go now. I'm not taking my full camera because I've got too much stuff. I need to lend a camera and I've got to put it in the bag. So I'll, I'll catch up in the I'll come get it. I'm just gonna say bye to you now and thank you so much for watching this week. I hope it's felt like a bit more of a chunky week. I've really tried to throw myself back into it a bit more and I've really enjoyed doing it. Um, me and James just shouted at me that he's cooked a big chilli and I honestly can't wait to eat it. It makes the best chilli. Um, but yes, I hope you're all okay. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in my next one. Bye.